all the lambs will become a plain for, for us, Father God, for all the lambs and for me. In Jesus Christ's name, Zechariah 4, 7. So, Father God, I thank you that all these scriptures that I prayed over the mountains in our lives, Father God, any mountain that we're going through, Father God, any mountain that any of the lambs are going through, there's a lot of different mountains in what I just mentioned. Any mountains of slavery, abuse, mountains of slander and gossip and jealousy and hatred directed against us, mountains of discrimination, mountains of witchcraft, mountains of sorcery and divination, Father God, mountains of social poverty, mountains of rejection, mountains of fear, Father God, mountains of disrespect, mountains of hate stalking, Father God, mountains of harassment, mountains of abuse, Father God, mountains of satanic ritual abuse, mountains of robbery and theft, Father God, it's all kind of mountains out there that all the lambs are going through and that I'm going through as one of your lambs. And I thank you that these these mountains are becoming plains in our lives, Father God. And these mountains are becoming chaffs, Father God, small in our lives, Father God. And I thank you for destroying every satanic mountain out of off our lives, Father God, with your holy fires and with the blood of Jesus Christ and the fires of the Holy Spirit off the lives of all the lambs out there. Father God, in the spiritual realm, these evil mountains of the enemy that come against your lambs, that come against me, Father God, with your holy fires down to the ashes, to the ground, to not. In Jesus Christ's name, and I ask, Father God, that you will cause all these mountains to melt by your holy fires and melt down by the blood of Jesus Christ in the lives of your lambs and in my life as well in Jesus Christ's name. So thank you, Father God, that all these prayers are done concerning mountains in our lives in Jesus Christ's name. Releasing the spoilers. I forgot to mention this earlier. I'm going to pray these prayers over you guys, too. Let, Father, I ask that you let the counsel of the wicked that come against the lambs, Father God, and that come against me be spoiled by your power and your might, Father God, in Jesus Christ's name, Job twelve seventeen. I ask, Father God, that you lead the princes of darkness that come against your lambs away spoiled in Jesus Christ's name, Job twelve nineteen. I ask, Father God, that you let the stout-hearted Father God, that come against your lambs that come against me be spoiled in Jesus Christ's name. Psalm 76, 5. I bind the enemy, the devil, Father God. I strip him of his armor and divide his walls. Father God, that come against any of the lambs that come against me in Jesus Christ's name. Luke eleven twenty two. I release the spoilers, Father God, to come upon Babylon and destroy her, Father God. So I pray, Father God, that you release the spoilers that come upon the spirit of Babylon that come against the lives of your lambs that come against my life and destroy, Father God, the spirit of Babylon that come against the lives of your lambs, the lambs that are being persecuted that come against my life in Jesus Christ's name. Jeremiah 51, 53. Father, I read. Lease the spoilers. I release the spoilers to come upon the high places. Father God, they come against your lambs, the high places in the name of Jesus Christ. The high places, Father God, operating in the spiritual realm that come against the lives of your lambs, that come against your, the lives of your lambs and that come against the persecuted lambs that come against me and my life, Father God, in the name of Jesus Christ. Jeremiah twelve twelve. Lord, I thank you that you have spoiled principalities and powers that come against the lives of your lambs, that come against your lambs, that come against my life and come against me in the spiritual realm in Jesus Christ's name. By your mighty power, Father God, Jesus have spoiled principalities and powers that come against the lambs in the spiritual realm in Jesus Christ's name. Thank you for Colossians, Colossians 2, 15. I spoil the enemy and take back his goods in the name of Jesus Christ. Father God, I spoil the enemy that come against the lambs and that come against me in my life. Father God, and I take back his goods. 
Father God, the goods of the devil that he has stolen from us, that he has stolen from all the lambs and from me, Father God, in the name of Jesus Christ. Exodus twelve thirty six. I spoil the tents of the enemy in the name of Jesus Christ. I spoil the tents of the enemy that come against me and the other lambs in the name of Jesus Christ. First Samuel seventeen fifty three. I spoil those that have attempted to spoil me and other lambs in Jesus Christ's name. I spoil those that have attempted to spoil me and other lambs in Jesus Christ's name. Ezekiel thirty nine ten. Father, I thank you that the enemy will not spoil me nor any of the lambs out there, but he will be spoiled in Jesus Christ's name. Isaiah 33, 1. I ask, Father God, that you let the palaces and palaces and headquarters of darkness be spoiled in the lives of all the persecuted light. In the lives of all the persecuted lambs and in my life as well in the name of Jesus Christ. Amos 3.11 I ask, Father, that you let the proud spirits that come against the lambs, that come against me, be spoiled in the name of Jesus Christ. Zechariah 11.3 Father, I release the canker worm, Father God, to spoil the works of darkness that come against the lives of the lambs, that come against my life, Father God, that come against the lives of the persecuted lambs, in the name of Jesus Christ. Nahum 3.16 Father, I ask that you let the fortresses of darkness, Father God, that come against the lives of all persecuted lambs and that come against my life, Father God, and that come against all the persecuted lambs, be spoiled in the name of Jesus Christ. Hosea ten fourteen. Heavenly Father God, I thank you that these scriptures are done in the lives of all lambs, Father God, that are being persecuted, Father God. Through any given slavery program, everywhere in this world, everywhere in America, everywhere in Canada, in Jesus Christ's name, Father God. So I give you glory and honor, Father God, for answering these prayers and listening to my prayers and hearing them and responding to them, Father God, and bringing results from the word of God, from your word that I have declared among your word, Father God, among all the lambs that are suffering and through any given slavery and persecution, through any given slavery program, Father God, everywhere in the world, everywhere in America and Canada, and in my life as well, because I'm being persecuted too and afflicted, Father God. So I thank you, Father God, that these prayers are done in our lives, Father God, according to the scriptures of your word, Father God, because you are faithful to keep the promises of your word, Father God, and perform your word in our lives, Father God. So I thank you for your word. I thank you for you and your goodness and your love and your mercy, Father God. And thank you for having mercy to answer my prayers for all the lambs out there, all your people that are being persecuted, all the lambs that are being persecuted, the innocent lambs out there and from children to adults, Father God. And having mercy on me too, Father God, as I'm being persecuted every day through this slavery program that I'm going through, this covert gain stocking program that I'm being persecuted through in Jesus Christ's name. So, Father, I just thank you and I praise you. Thank you for the God that you are, the good God you are, and being good to your lambs, being good to the innocents. Father God, that you care about us and you love us and you care to deliver us. So, Father God, I ask that you will cover and seal this prayer, these prayers that I prayed in this episode, including the episode and the uploading of it with the blood of Jesus Christ in Jesus Christ's name. And, Father God, I praise you and I thank you. You are great and mighty. Hallelujah. Amen. Jesus 
As far as the east is from the west As far as he's taken our sins from us Jesus The life he gave upon the cross The sacrifice that was paid for us Jesus Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. 